How Xbox Fans Feel in 2024 by Mighty Keith. If it's one thing that Mighty Keith is gonna do, is troll the hell out of the Xbox fans, bro. Hey, listen, Xbox fans, dog, listen to me, bro. I'm not even trying to talk down to y'all. I'm not trying to shit on y'all, bro. It's sad how Xbox is going out, bro. Xbox used to be on top of gaming at one point in time. Now they over here trash, bro. Like, there's literally, literally zero reason to purchase an Xbox in 2024. Why would you ever shoot yourself in the foot by buying a goddamn Xbox? You ain't got no games. Ain't nothing to play. This is not me talking as a Sony head. I'm just talking as a gamer. If I was a gamer and I wanted to find a console, you know, I'm not talking about PC, Xbox, PlayStation, or Nintendo Switch. I choose Nintendo Switch over Xbox right now. I'm not lying. I know y'all think I'm just trying to be, you know, facetious. I'm really not. I'm serious, bro. That is crazy, dog. Xbox, step it up. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I ain't saying you got to come back to the glory days, but just, you know, step up your game, baby. We need competition in the gaming industry, bro. Whenever games don't have competition, the game that doesn't have the competition suffers, bro. So Xbox, the thing that's pushed gaming forward so much is the rivalry between Xbox and Sony. If there's no rivalry no more and Sony is just winning by miles, Sony gonna start doing bullshit too. Not that they haven't already done some bullshit, but at the very least, us Sony heads still have games to play. You can't deny it. You can't deny it. You just, you can't deny it. We have games to play, Xbox don't. So I don't know, man, get it together. But we about to go ahead and watch this video by Mighty Keith and see how he trolls the fans. Without further ado, let it. I am Mighty Let's go. Keith. Thanks everyone, I hope you enjoyed the show. Summer Games Fest, oh my goodness. Seriously. Oh my God, that was horrible. Why are they mad? I don't get it. <laughs> oh, you don't get it? <laughs> Bro. You got 50 million consoles out there, man. Would be nice to have some new games for them. What you mean? I got Concord coming out. Y'all spent 10 minutes man, forget of your state Concord. of play hyping up that Overwatch adjacent ass game. <laughs> and we ain't got shit at my fest. You know, hey, let, me, let me not do it like that. Let me not do it like that. I don't want to say forget Concord. The game could be fun. I'm just saying I'm not hype for that. Listen, I, like I told y'all, bro, I ain't going to let Sony off the hook either. You know what I'm saying? We have games coming, though. You know what I'm saying? We got games coming. And we're going to play them when they come out. But you know what I'm saying? I can't. I think that they're saving all the big uh, reveals for this year. We really ain't getting on some game fest. I think they're saving everything for the game awards later this year. We're gonna see. So we're caught. Hopefully the Xbox does too. Ah, come on. These guys buy the same Call of Duty every year, but PlayStation Overwatch is where they draw the line. That's true. It looks like it's for people who put glue on top of Tide <laughs> Pods and then eat them. Nigga, what? <laughs> looks like it's for boring, <laughs> crack smoking. Damn, was this just a Concord this video? Found my stepsister stuck in the dryer ass niggas. Damn, okay. What are you calling boring? Where is Nintendo, man? Has anyone seen them? You rang? Hello? <laughs> Where's your stuff at? My stuff? Oh, hey, man. You must be talking about the new Legend of Zelda game coming out this year, where you can actually play a Zelda. That look like, it's Something okay. It look okay. For, for decades. <laughs> and the Luigi Mansion 2 HD, uh, the Donkey Kong Country Returns HD, oh and the God. Metroid Prime 4. Are those the stuff in question? People have been waiting a long time for Metroid Prime 4, but they arguably too damn long. It's not even hype no more. It's like, okay, yay, finally. And uh, the, the new Legend of Zelda game where you actually get to play a Zelda in Link's Awakening style, looks like it could be okay. It looked like it'd be fun. I, I'm not trying to, again, I ain't trying to, I ain't trying to shit on. I have a Nintendo Switch, so I ain't gonna shit on the library. You know, so it looked like it'd be fun. Uh, they read Donkey Kong Country Returns. Was it Tropical Freeze or was it just Country Returns that they're remaking? I don't fucking remember, but I mean, they're gonna be good games, but like hype, it's not the word that I would use, but I mean, Nintendo's gearing up for a whole new console. You know what I'm saying? The Switch 2 or whatever they're gonna call it is uh, probably gonna get revealed either later this year or next year. So, you know, they're doing that. I, I'm, I'm looking forward to that more than like, you know, games. Cause after that, they're gonna start announcing games. You feel me? Mario Odyssey 2, anybody? I don't know, man. Mario Odyssey is the best Super Mario 3D game made to date to me. So it's a sequel would just be phenomenal. Galaxy yes. 3? Yeah, no, I'm gonna do that at my own thing. Oh, oh, you're gonna do your own thing. Okay, <laughs> you're just gonna do his own thing. Someone pass me my gun. Somebody care about the damn Nintendo Toodaloo. Directs. But shout out to uh, Marvel though, you know what I'm saying? The hero to save the day. What are you blabbing about, man? I get Marvel 4 now. Where's Ghost of Tsushima 2? One day. Where's That's true. Ratchet and Clank? Another Sly Cooper. That's coming. If only there was some we, I wish Sly Cooper. Came out of nowhere and beat up the villain. <laughs> the villain being lack of new game announcements. Well, well, well. <laughs> You must be very desperate. <laughs> oh my God! To call on me. Best music. I can't open anyone but him. Next my boy Sale, aka Daddy Big Bucks. Hey. 
What are you gonna do to satiate these raging animals? See, all those years of failure have taught me one thing. What? You bring out games people like, you get success. So let's bring out the games people like. Okay. <laughs> wait a minute. New of okay. war. Yeah. Oh my god. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Why would you? I can't see it, bro. Black Ops 6, Indiana Jones, Gears of War. Oh, yeah, the next Gears of War. Doom, Avowed. Is that Diablo? What the hell is that right there? A uh, Flight Simulator. Okay. Warcraft, Dragon Age, Assassin's Creed, Shadows. I mean, all of these are exclusives. These are these are definitely not all exclusives. Why are you putting these up here like these are exclusives? I mean, some of them look good. I mean, y'all look, I'll try to do a zoom in so y'all can see the game better because I can't see it, goddammit. But some of them are good, some of them are eh, but they're not even exclusives. So why I don't know why he's showing it from Xbox this perspective of being like, hey, I just came through. Oh my God. Weed. I ain't gonna lie, man. Xbox, you came through and you uh, saved the day. Uh, Line up now that people are looking forward to. That's gonna increase Game Pass subscribers. <laughs> What's your next move? Definitely sell out here on my Game Pass. Oh no. Boy, that's just crazy. What was that? No, don't tell me they're about to raise the price of Game Pass, bro. Now, to be 100% fair, Game Pass's current price is already a goddamn steal, which is why I've had Game Pass since I've had a PC. But I'm just saying, bro, don't increase the price. Don't do us like this. Who remembers the days when Netflix was like a six, seven dollar subscription? I remember those days. Netflix costs hella bread now. God damn it. Damn, bro. <laughs> I don't know, man. But hey, I mean, all of those games coming to Game Pass is fire but those aren't like xbox exclusives those games you can get those games on other consoles too but i will be getting them on game pass because i have game pass so i guess it'll still make it worth the price if even if they increase the price of game pass but god damn it i don't know man but still uh xbox y'all need to get your shit together on these damn exclusives exclusives are literally the number one reason to buy a console that's the reason that nintendo has any relevance in the gaming war they never can compete on the technological side when it comes to uh, gaming uh, peripherals and gaming hardware, but they got exclusives. They got the games you can't play nowhere else. You wanna play Legend of Zelda? Need a Nintendo console. You wanna play Donkey Kong? Need a Nintendo console. You wanna play Super Mario? Need a Nintendo console. I'm not talking about emulation, obviously, by the way. Even if you're doing that, you're still emulating a Nintendo console. Let me stop ranting. <laughs> hey man, funny ass video by Mighty Keith, bruh. The gaming industry, uh, is, I mean, I ain't gonna say it's in shambles, but it, we, we we need more. We need more. And I'm waiting for more. God damn it. But hey, make sure y'all show a lot of love to this video. Like, share, and subscribe. Give me y'all thoughts and opinions down in the comment section on this video, on this reaction. And yeah, leave a like before you get up out of here. If y'all love the video, like, share, and subscribe. Till next time we up out of this thing. It's your boy Dow. We signing out. Peace.